All right, let's go, guys. Fucking glory. Aerith. There's that giggle. Very impressive. I really must thank you for providing me such invaluable combat data. Cocky little egghead, ain't you? The results provided by my predictive models indicate that this force should be more than capable of handling you. Y'all about to learn predictable. <laughs> We're taking Aerith back. Oh, take her back, you say? Correct me if I am wrong, but did the girl not come here of her own free will? Or do you mean to tell me that she is your personal property? She only came here to save Marlene! I'm afraid you misunderstand. Okay. <laughs> but I really can't be bothered to explain. This facility is home to extraordinary specimens that will change the world as we know it. Do try to be considerate. <laughs> Alright, one down. How's that for predictable? Looks like your models got it wrong. Yes, an unknown variable, perhaps. Well, no matter. Reinforcements will soon arrive. <sighs> Cocky, but will fuck. they get here in time to save you from me? Why are you a soldier? Yeah. Yeah. No. Ah, uh, here we go! Ghosts! What? What? what is this fascinating phenomenon? More, more of this bullshit. Where are you taking me? What are those things up to this time? Cloud! Barrett. Got Get her out of there. Stand back. Wait, wait. That wasn't what I had him equipped with. Okay, awesome. No bestiality in this one. Thanks for saving Molly. I owe you one. Save it for later. These are interesting. There we go. Aerith, you okay? Mm -hmm. Thank you. No biggie. Let's get out of here. Yes! Moo! Go be free, my friend! The hell was that thing? We need to go. Aerith! It was gonna be Aerith's boyfriend in the first game. Come on. Alright, yeah, get him! Just like, what the fuck? So mad. <laughs> Looks even more badass in this game. What? You want to go? Stop. No, no, no. This child's a friend. I pet you. Good doggo.
Okay. Steal your mind. Good doggo. Does he talk? Is he gonna talk? Uh, so what the hell is it? Come on. Come on. Say your words. A fascinating question. Yes! <laughs> Did it just talk? You asked what it is. Hmm. I am that which you see before you. Best theme song in the whole game. Right here. I'd appreciate it if we simply left it at that. Agreed. I'm bringing that flute. Thirteen? Red Thirteen. The designation given to me by Hojo. Then... You must have another name. What is it? Oh, what was, his, what was his actual name? It was like a really cool tribal name. He got away. Like Hakoji so, or some shit. So, we're gonna go get the son of a bitch. Oh, damn it. Come on, Cloud. Nanaki, that's right. I'm tripping balls. Ugh. Drugs are bad, kids. I have come for you. Yeah, here we go. Genova. Together we will reclaim our world. Mother. <laughs> oh, I believe this is headless mother. Uh, or just the head, I can't remember. Yes, Tifa and Earth sandwich. Oh, the Turks. You know, Reno, I think you might be due for some R&R. &R. You're not kidding. Look at him. Nah, I'm good. What are we going to do about Sector 7? We are going to do nothing. Been thinking. Was all that necessary? Not really. Had we refused, someone else would have completed the task. We have spared that someone the burden of a guilty conscience. Perhaps that will ease yours. <sighs> yeah. No. <laughs> Let's try another tack then. They were a sacrifice to balance the scales. Say what? After everything we'd taken from the planet, we were due to give something back. Do you actually believe that? Does it matter? Hmm. Pick up the phone. Yes, understood. The VP needs us. Shit's going on. Deliverance from chaos. Cloud. Oh, 
Thank goodness. You're awake. <sighs> you okay? Yeah. Where are we? Where I lived when I was still a child. Hmm. All the post-it notes. I, talk to I don't want you to push yourself. We're all worried. Well, you know, I just kind of had a drug trip, so it, it is what it is. What about you? You know, talk don't to scare me? us like that, man. I do like, like, it, and, and it kind of kept that relationship between Cloud and Barrett. Like, they didn't like each other, Not but they kind sleep. of, they kind of became friends. My mom and I stayed here years ago when I was just a little girl. The room looks exactly the same. You're a good artist. Is there anyone else I can talk to? Are you about? okay? Maybe you should rest a little longer. I'm the one who carried you here. You carried me? Think me. Every morning, they'd come and take my mom away. I remember crying here alone. <clears throat> Aerith, before we break out of here, talk to us. There's so much we don't know. I'm a descendant of the ancients. That's pretty much it, really. Oh, but just so you know, that's not their actual name. <laughs> they called themselves Cetra. the Cetra. We who were born of the planet, with her we speak, her flesh we shape. Unto her promised land shall we one day return. By her loving grace and providence, may we take our place in paradise. Hmm. You know it. Yeah, well, honestly, I thought that part was just a fairy tale. Mm. Shinra thinks it's true. They've been searching for the promised land for a long time. Doesn't want to make money off it, dickheads. And they must think you can lead them to it. Can you? <sighs> Nope. Someday, maybe, I'll find it in me. But now, not even if I wanted to. <laughs> even if you could, that land belongs to the... I mean, to you and your people. Shinra's after it because they believe it's rich in Mako. Mako, they've got no right to claim. But they'll try to take it anyway, won't they? Of course they will. Greedy bastards will never stop. Okay, new plan. Y'all take Aerith and get the hell out of here. Me, I'm gonna go bust some Shinra heads. Barrett, wait. You can't do that. Not good on plot device. Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh, great. These assholes again. Probably some Shinra science experiment. No, no plot device. Perhaps best described as arbiters of fate. Plot device. They are drawn to those who attempt to alter destiny's course and ensure they do not. Like capital D? Destiny? The flow of the great river that is the planet, from inception to oblivion. Hmm. And you're saying that that flow is somehow... fixed? Yes. For it is the will of the planet itself. So if we're destined for a bleak future, these whispers will try to keep us on that course? Now wait just a damn minute. How in the hell can you possibly know any of that? Spouting that cryptic stuff, which could all be bullshit. I mean, ain't you a Shinra lab rat or dog? That's kind of fucked up, man. Not a rat dog. Not a rat dog. When Aerith reached out to me, I found this knowledge of the Whispers. Listen to me. Please. Aerith. 
Not a rat dog. The Shinra Electric Power Company isn't the real enemy. It started with them, sure. But I promise you, there's a much bigger threat. Yeah, his name's Sephiroth. I just want to do everything in my power to help. All of you. And the planet. Aerith, what are you not telling us? Genova. I'm lost in a maze, and every step is taking me further from the path. Every time the whispers touch me, I lose something, a part of myself. <laughs> Follow them, the yellow flowers. I think she's losing her fucking gourd. Again? <laughs> Weird. Okay. So it wants me to go towards the TVs, obviously. Uh -huh. Hi guys, remember there me? You are. Rick, what are you doing, man? Hey guys, long time no see. Oh, good old wedge. Wedge. You're here? You you shouldn't be up and moving. I'm feeling much better thanks to Elmira's cooking. Good old Elmira. Ah, but that's not what I wanted to talk to you about. Listen, any moment now. <laughs> what was that? An explosion? Anomalous sugar than HQ is running the show this time. They're raising hell to try and flush out the president. This complicates matters. That explosion just now put the whole building on high alert. Great. So now we're trapped in here? Engaging lockdown protocol. No need to panic, little lady. See? You can still move freely within Hojo's laboratory. Find a way to the roof. An avalanche chopper will come to extract you. HQ's bailing us out. Well, this I is a different way. After all the shit we've pulled. I asked them really nicely. <laughs> like super duper nicely. Thanks, Wedge. Just get to the roof, okay? I'm glad Wedge made it. Uh, oh. Uh, oh. I didn't ask him to do any of that. Yeah. Be well, happy. I'm glad he did. Huh? <laughs> I'm gonna still chew him out for it later.